weather now. Rain and hail falling in some parts of the high country. A viewer sent in this video of the hail falling in Portola. And for a closer look now at the activity in the Sierra, let's check in with KCRA 3 meteorologist Dirk Fedor. Yeah, we're going to take a closer look at that thunder cell as it made its way through Portola. It's now exiting to the north. Currently 88 degrees in Sacramento. We have sunny skies and a southwest wind blowing at 11 miles per hour. That breeze is going to help to cool things off tonight, but not, not as quickly as it did last night. But we had a strong delta breeze yesterday and into early this morning from Sacramento to Stockton, where we currently have mainly clear skies above 92 degrees with a northwest wind blowing at 10 miles per hour. In Modesto, currently some sunshine, 93 degrees currently with a northwest wind at 12 miles per hour. In Fairfield, we have a strong, nice little breeze there, southwest at 21 miles per hour. Temperature 83 degrees. The only problem is the marine layer is not as thick as it was, and so we're not getting as much of a cooling effect from that nice onshore breeze. Currently at Lake Tahoe, We've had uh, some sunshine. Still looking at uh, fairly sunny skies. We do have some high cloud cover out there. 76 degrees in the southwest wind blowing at 8 miles per hour. All the thunderstorm activity has been staying mainly to the south, except for that one cell near Portola. Current, or I should say, daytime high temperatures that we had today. 94 degrees is where we peaked out through Sacramento, Stockton, and Modesto. 88 in Fairfield, 91 in Marysville. Upper 80s to lower 90s through Placerville and Auburn. And temperatures ranged in the mid to low 80s through Truckee as well as Lake Tahoe. Thunderstorm activity in the mountains. Again, this is zoom. In Plumas County. There it is. This is the cell that prompted a severe thunderstorm warning in the area. You can see where Portola is, and there was some pretty large hail associated with this, some strong gusty winds, and lots of lightning strikes. And again, this is all moving from the south to the north, and it's bringing some fairly heavy rain with it as well. So we could see some just some localized areas of flooding in that region. To the south, though, things kind of dying out just to the south of Lake Tahoe, but things really do blossom as we work our way through Mono County and into Inyo County. We see lots of lightning. Strikes. In fact, some very heavy downpours prompting a flash flood warning in through Inyo County from that particular cell at this point. This stretches all the way into southern Nevada as well. This is all that monsoonal moisture coming up from the south. This is going to continue as we go into tomorrow, but most of it should shunt a little bit more to the east. And so we're not going to see as much activity bumping up against the Sierra, but we will still see some more showers and thunderstorms for tomorrow. Futurecast shows us the development of that. As we go through tonight, things should kind of wind down a little bit, but as we head through your Sunday, we'll see a few more showers popping up. It looks like it's going to be just to the east of Lake Tahoe, but also over the coastal mountains, we have a good chance for some more showers and thunderstorms in those areas. As we hit through Monday, most of it's going to be pushing off into Nevada, while we'll have mainly clear skies across Northern California. Forecast temperatures. Let's take a look at your numbers for tomorrow. Temperatures will be warming into the lower 80s through Truckee and Lake Tahoe. Get a slight threat for a thunderstorm around Lake Tahoe, but again, maybe more on the eastern shore as opposed to the south or to the west. 82 in Truckee, 89 in Quincy, 84 degrees your forecast in Arnold. Angels Camp 91, 88 in Placerville, 87 degrees through Grass Valley with mostly sunny skies and winds. This will be picking up a little bit, but between 5 to 10 miles per hour as we head through the afternoon. We'll see a little bit of cloud cover in the morning for San Francisco. That should burn off and give us some uh, sunshine and temperature daytime high of 67 degrees, 81 in Concord, Napa, 78 in Fairfield, warming up to 82 degrees. Temperatures ranging in the lower 90s tomorrow for Modesto and Turlock, 90 in Stockton, 88 degrees in Lodi. Temperatures are expected to be a little bit cooler tomorrow than they were today. 90 in Woodland, 93 in Marysville, 93 in Roseville, and 92 degrees for Folsom. Your seven day forecast shows conditions staying mostly sunny to sunny. Temperatures continue to drop as we head from Sunday on into Monday. Look at that 80 degree temperatures in that range, and the overnight temperatures ranging in the upper 50s to lower 60s. So looking pretty good for next week. Nice to get a break.